वेलकम बैक आई होप यू डूइंग वेल तीज को समय छोर खानु तीज पर मना चैट डांस कर आज लेट्स गेट इन टू बिजनेस सो आई बिन एक्सप्लेनिंग यू हो ल स्कूल में एडमिट कसरी होने अस पीछे लडमिशन को होल प्रोसेस बीएलएलबी को होल प्रोसेस को बारे में भरी रख थे तर आज इट्स गोइंग टू बी अ लिटल डिफ्रेंट इन टर्म्स अफ वर्ड भादा आई टेल यू व्हाट प्रोग्राम्स टू अप्लाई फर और व्हाट प्रोग्राम्स टू जोइन इन आफ्टर यू आर अलरेडी एडमिटेड इन अ ल स्कूल सो लेट मी गिव यू अ कॉन्टेक्स्ट यू माइ बी थिंकिंग वॉट should i get involved in a program in law school i just study for my exams i give my exams and that's it unsan me tau ko kina dukhai rakhnu pare law school ma gar what programs do i apply for is it necessary is it not is it compulsory is it optional what bhanne question aai ra gola dimag ma tar law school bhanne ko chai it's a little different than other schools so lag sai malai chai kina ke पांच वर्ष में वॉट यू डू इज यू ट्रेन यूर सेल्फ टू बिकम अ लॉयर एंड यू डोट बिकम अ लॉयर वेन यू जस्ट अपेयर फर यू इक्जाम्स रिड रिड फर द इक्जाम्स हो जो एवरी इयर एवं सर अफ क्वेश्चन आँच यू आंसर दैट एंड यू बिकम अ लॉयर इन फाइव इयर्स और टेन इयर्स नो यू डोट बिकम लॉयर जस्ट लाइक दैट आई फील लाइक मेरे पर्सनल एक्सपीरियंस के भादा खेल यू नीड टू फीड यूर सेल्फ वेल यू नीड टू ट्रेन यूर सेल्फ वेल टू बी अ लॉयर टू बी एबल टू एनालाइज थिंग टू बी एबल टू काउंसिल योर क्लायंट्स वेन एवर दे कम टू यू विथ अ केस अफ मर्डर और विथ अ केस अफ सुसाइड विथ अ केस अफ किडनैप जुने सीरियस खाल कोई केस आने यू सुड बी एबल टू हेन्डल इट कन्फिडेन्टली एंड वेन वेन आर यू कन्फिडेन्ट वेन यू आर अलरेडी एक्सपीरियंस्ड वेन यू हेव अलरेडी फेस द सिचुएसन बिफोर अभी कुछ रियल क्लाइंट आई सके फर्स्ट टाइम एक्सपीरियंस होना बट देन ल स्कूल कैन इफ यू ट्राई इट कैन एक्सपोज यू टू अर एन्वाइरमेंट वे यू लर्न all of these skills pre hand and i'll tell you all about these programs where you can learn when you, you can get the trainings of becoming an advocate becoming a good oralist good researcher and so on so let's get started drama so the programs that i'll recommend you today are the actual programs that i participated in during my law school so the first program that i will definitely 100% recommend you is the moot court competition म मेरे जुनियर जैसे भेदाखे आई टेल दैम प्लिज डू पार्टिसिपेट भाई कंपिटिशन हो क्योंकि इट हेज रियली हेल्प मी टू स्ट्रेंदन मेरे हो प्लिडिंग स्किल मेरे ओरल स्किल्स एंड ओल्सो माई रिसर्च स्किल मुट कोर्ट कंपि ओके मुट कोर्ट भाई के सो मुट कोर्ट इज ए मक कोर्ट वेर ल स्टूडेंट आर यू इन एन इमेजिनेरी केस फर द सेक अफ प्क्टिस इमेजिन कर दिस इज अ कोर्ट देर इज अ कोर्ट Uh, it's actual court scenario where there is a judge there are two lawyers and there are observers moot court thake this way huncha the only difference moot court has from actual court is that a jun judge huncha ni they are hypothetical i mean no they are not hypothetical they are just huncha ni they are mock judge who might be an expert or professor but they are not actual judge you act as a lawyer you are not an actual lawyer but then you act as one and defend your case and there is a defense counsel who also does the same and there are actual observers who might be your friends your family anybody of a so moot court ma chai you are given a hypothetical case euta set of papers set of papers haru ma chai euta case deko huncha imaginary case janeri chai murder ko or environment sambandhi conflict euta case deko huncha haina tyo case ko aadhar ma chai etimi applicant ho ya defendant ho tyo aadhar ma chai aphno केस लाई फाइदा होने गरी तिमी चाहिँ केस हरु फाइन्ड गर्छौ ल हरु फाइन्ड गर्छौ हैन अनि इभन डेफिनेशन्स हरु पनि फाइन्ड गर्छौ जुन चाहिँ तिम्रो केस लाई फाइदा हुन्छ एन्ड देन यु डु योर रिसर्च अनि यु राइट इट यु राइट एभ्रीथिङ सुरुमा तिमीले मेमोरियल सबमिट गर्नु पर्ने हुन्छ जानेर चाहिँ तिमीले आफ्नो रिसर्चहरु सबै लेखेको हुन्छ एउटा मेमोरियलमा अन द बेसिस अफ व्हिच क्लाइन्ट दैट यु आर रिप्रेजेंटिंग एप्लिकेन्ट अर डिफेंडेंट हैन अनि त्यसपछि चाहिँ देयर इज एन एक्चुअल प्लीडिङ जानेर चाहिँ तिमी कम्पिटिसनमा जान्छौ अनि त्यहाँ जज हुन्छ जज आस्क यु आस्क यु series of question and you, and then you answer it you also rebut to the, your defense uh, counsel you know and this whole experience really builds up your uh, analysis skill your research skill your patience skill because it takes a good two months for a law student to 
uh, to practice and prepare for your actual the final mood court competition some might take like five months uh, it's it's really challenging and it's 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 so fruitful i recommend everybody so i'll tell you the name of each mood court competition so that you can google search yourself and if you want to apply you can do that number one yeah henry dunant uh, competition it is organized by icrc it is an international uh, international competition uh, which focuses on humanitarian issues where you get to learn so much about war crime crime against humanity act of aggression or homicide the second one is slams international mood court competition organized by this organization nepal based organization called slams uh, it also deals with humanitarian law the third one is PN Vaguti Mudkut competition organized by New Law School in India. It focuses on human rights uh, issues. When I participated in 2017, it covered the issue of uh, law of seas. The fourth one is um, the Luson Academy Mudkut competition, which is organized in one of the summer school in Luson, Switzerland. Um, it also deals with humanitarian law and, and when I participated, it focused more on migration laws issue. So the second program that I would definitely recommend any law student would be a summer school. A summer school is a week or a month long school which is dedicated on particular issue or area of interest. The one I participated focused on migration laws where I got to know about the refugee law in Europe, the migration laws in Europe, uh, what the responsibility of EU is or what uh, all action EU has been doing in order to address all these uh, refugee problems in, in, in the region. Uh, so it was really fr fruitful in terms of uh, me being far from home, being familiar with uh, a very new uh, law in Europe, um, as opposed to that, I was only learning the law of uh, South Asia or, or, or mainly dedicated on the laws of, you know, specifically about Nepal. But now I got to know so much about the European laws and also the problems that they have from here, from Nepal. We are like, OK, we have problems. We have a lot of problems. But back there, they have a lot of uh, problems to deal with. Too. and there are laws that address that and I was very fortunate to be one of the uh, participants who uh, got to uh, you know uh, participate in the mood court, uh, I mean the summer school and subsequently the mood court competition um, uh, during the end at the end of summer school so it was a really uh, a rewarding experience for me. So the third program that I would also like to recommend you is the conferences. So I have participated in four conferences so far on the area of my interest in uh, my internet governance, my interest at Boira. I mainly apply in those conferences and I got accepted in few and so you can also apply in few for conference on the on sunny uh, on on your field of interest um, some might be in environment law others can be in IP law or or property law or you know women's right issue and, and and you know LGBTIQ right issues and so much more there are a lot of conferences happening every year every month in fact in both national level and international level um, there are a lot of fully funded opportunity that you can seek for, that you can search and uh, do apply. Uh, it is really, really rewarding because um, it is a place where you can establish your network. And so I hope with this video, you have something to take away and you'll actually go and apply in some of these conferences. Because trust me, after the law school is over, you want to look back and not only like, you know, cherish the moment that you spend in your law school, but also in the conferences and the network you build, the uh, friends uh, that you make in these conferences are something that is worth keeping. And um, if you've not subscribed to the channel, do subscribe to the channel and also hit the bell icon so that if I upload a new video, then you'll get a notification when I do that. And goodbye and I'll see you soon. Send me lots of love. Bye-bye.